good morning everyone tisay here so the other day um i was planting all my dahlias so that's the dahlia that i um put it in the basement um, to preserve it then that is the dahlia that was a uh, trade and then some dahlias were um i bought this year so that is, are all the dahlias i got from that box those are the leftover actually of the um, dahlias that i sold so they all have a uh, sprout already yes they have a sprout already i'm not so sure if you can see it from here so anyway so we're going to put that uh, in, those are the dahlias that are my new collection this year uh, the rest of the dahlias were red color and then those four tuber right there those were the different colors of the dahlia that was trade to me with my red one when i posted it online to sell my my dahlia and she was very nice that she uh, swapped with me or trade me with different um, colors. So I'm so excited about it. Oh, see, I, you can see it from right there. The sprouts of the dahlia is already. Um, so you can tell that, you know, they are. Because the tuber looks like they're dying. They're, they're no good anymore. But they're not actually. They're, they're, they're good. The, those are just the normal looks. So what I did this time because um, I only just put them all in a one row. So this year um, and then the rest of the leftover I had, I gave it to my friend. So as you see, I, I have a um, medicine bottles in there. So I had a lot of those because I have a maintenance and um, my problem here is like when i put a marker uh labels i usually it faded away and then you know when when i come back and see what they are and, and i don't know anymore because they're faded so what i did is i uh, put the uh, marker um in in the mark in the label and uh, stick and then I put them inside in the uh, medicine um, bottle and then that is what I use for marker so that's an experiment so let's see how good that will um, do for me so anyway um, the walkway last year I did not put a uh, weed mat in there so I really have a hard time uh, I'm getting old, so I re weeding is really my enemies now. Back then, it, it is not a problem, but now you know it, it is. So I put a weed mat on, then right that green row that's right beside into where I put all the dahlias. Um, those are a black eyed Susan. So what i i did is i just lay it all out all the way one line and then we i alternated it with uh the new collections i had like every three uh clumps of the um dahlia the the red dahlia that i have i i put the the uh, new collections and so every three clumps and then new collections and then three clumps of the red one and then the new collection so when which is uh it went perfectly from from one you know from the whole line of the um, area so i'm so excited for this one so uh, here um as you see the weed mat is way very close to the black eye susan so what i did is i just kind of fold it like six inches you know i fold it rather than you know folding it all the way a foot of it i just i just um fold it one 
one half of the four so six inches because that that um with my uh that's four feet wide so i just staple it and then and then put it down like that so actually i did um i will show you guys li uh, later on as well about what i what i did on the um weed map so basically i i did put a stone in there already so the stone should hold uh strong enough for for the weed mat to hold so i'm going to collect the all the uh, staples that i have there on that on that line but anyway so i dig a hole um about four four to six inches of of the uh, of the holes to to put the dahlia the whole tuber actually you don't have to put the whole tuber in there um you know even because like even the trade one i have it was only one tube one tuber um it, it will still you know it will still give you um a, a good amount of the you know of the plant but since i have plenty and i don't really have enough space to put them around my 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 garden anymore so why why not you know the advantage of it though right uh, from one clump to the to only one um tuber to plant is that the the clumps once it comes up it became um it becomes uh more bushier than just the one tuber so so i got it all done and then um as you see the the bottle um the marker that i put him in there so hopefully it will not um blow away from the wind either so let's just um watch guys so for the update of this thank you